Do you know what bug spray, cosmetics, cinnamon, and lavender have in common? It's linalool. Linalool, aka beta linalool, linalool alcohol, 3,7-dimethyl octo-1,6-diene-3-ol, and finally, plus and minus linalool. S plus linalool on the left side and R minus linalool on the right side make up the plus and minus linalool. They are known as enantiomers, which really just means they are mirror images of each other but cannot be switched around. The common example of this is your left and right hand. Even though they are mirror images of each other, they perform different functions. Now breaking down the preferred name is pretty simple. 3,7-dimethyl meaning that there are carbon bonds on the 3 and 7 spots on the chain, octa being that the longest chain is 8, 1,6-diene showing that there are double bonds on the 1 and 6 on the chain, and 3-ol showing a hydrogen oxygen on the third spot on the chain. In nature, linalool is found in things like lavender, cinnamon, mint, basil, and, where I see it most, cannabis. By itself, linalool is an anti-inflammatory, an epileptic, a sedative, and helps with vitamin E production and lessens anxiety. With THC or CBD added, you also get increased benefits like anti-tumor, stronger muscle relaxer, and antidepressant. The scents of S plus linalool are lighter flavors like sweet and floral, while R minus linalool has deep flavors like woody and lavender. Uses include many cosmetics like perfume, soaps, and shampoos. However, where I use it most is for relaxation and deep sleeping. Linalool synergizes with other terpenes like myrosine, limonene, and carophyllene. Well, my top three is easily linalool, limonene, and myrosine. That's all the time we have for today. If you'd like to know more information on terpenes, please visit the website in the description. Otherwise, have a great day.